now, your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Bryant Madrick. Here are your top stories for Saturday, June 13th. Today, there are several events planned to address racial injustice. Starting at 10 this morning, there is a community conversation for change. The focus is on empowering and uplifting Kansas City's black community. It's happening at Ruby Jean's Juicery on Troost. Then at 2.30, there is a Nail for Nine demonstration at 63rd and Brookside. It will be part of a nationwide demonstration marking the death of George Floyd. Then at 6 tonight, the Black Lives Matter protest begins with speakers. Tonight, they plan to focus on defunding police. That's at the J.C. Nichols Memorial Fountain on the plaza. Movie theaters are beginning to reopen. B&B Theaters and Liberty open Friday with changes. They are only opening up for Friday through Sunday as of now. Showtimes are also spread out to limit occupancy and give employees extra time to clean. Seats inside theaters will also be spaced out to keep up with social distancing. AMC hopes to reopen their theaters by July. Unfortunately, studios aren't releasing new movies in theaters just yet, so you'll have previous releases to choose from. Your forecast is next. Thanks, Bryant. Today, 90 degrees hot with moderate humidity, which means a little bit higher than yesterday, a little bit more wind, but pretty hot. 68 tonight, 90 on Sunday, hot and more humid, even though there'll be a little more of a breeze. It's going to be pretty hot out there. Monday, 93, hot and humid, south wind at 10 to 20. In order to have a heat wave, you need three straight days of highs of 95 or higher. Look at Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, awfully close to having a heat wave. So that is certainly possible and not much rain until the end of the week, Thursday and Friday. Still pretty humid and hot, but hopefully we'll get some rain by then. Have a great weekend and you get your news and weather anytime on KSHP.com.